Heather McCafferty at the Eastern Michigan University Undergraduate Symposium. I'm here speaking with the Director of Academic Programs Abroad, George Klein, and he's going to talk to us today about um, the events after 9-11. Hi, Heather. Hi. We had two semester-long study abroad programs going last fall. We had one throughout Europe and one throughout Asia. Uh, they started at the end of August. Obviously, after September 11th, we had some serious questions to ask about whether we could continue with the programs, and if so, what kinds of changes would we need to make? And parents were very concerned. We were very concerned. So we had a series of meetings with officials here at EMU, and we tried to figure out whether we could make some itinerary changes and keep the programs going. Right in the middle of all of that, I got this email forwarded to me from the mother of one of our students. He was on the Asian Cultural History Tour. And the email was a journal of his experiences up to that point. And they were so full of uh, perceptions and, and awarenesses and uh, experiences that we had hoped that all the students would have that it came as a breath of fresh air uh, to, to me. And I felt it was important to share this email with the officials who were deliberating with me about whether these programs could continue. So I, I forwarded the email to a number of these EMU officials, and the word began to spread that there was this really perceptive student in Asia who was writing emails about his experiences. And that eventually led to this invitation to uh, submit his work for the symposium. We were able to keep both programs out until their end. We had to change the itineraries and uh, somewhat, and it was a constant struggle to do that. But uh, everybody got back safely, and uh, the student who uh, wrote the emails also has now put images to the text, and that's what we're presenting here today. Hi, we're here talking with Nicholas Patalan Thompson about his experiences in Asia after 9-11. He emailed home um, to George Klein about his experiences and it kind of was one of the things that allowed the trip to continue. Nick, did you have some things you want to tell us about your experiences? I suppose that they were uh, as profound as anything I've ever experienced. I think that the rest of the world is incredible. And um, as North Americans, but it's sort of closed off to a lot. And we're very ethnocentric. And I thought it was incredible to see <laughs> places like India and see how they uh, function and survive in China and see that they do it sometimes not so well and sometimes fairly well. And, and the people everywhere are beautiful. And um, the food everywhere is, is, is pretty good. It was, it was wonderful. I had a great time. That's going to wrap it up for today. I'd like to thank George and Nicholas for joining us. And we're going to go take a look at some other booths.